Welcome back to Google Guru. Today I'm going to show you how to access your Gmail messages when you don't have an internet connection. Now there are a number of ways to do this, but I'm going to show you how you can do it through your Chrome browser. So first we're going to open up a new tab and then go to the Chrome Web Store. From here you can search Gmail offline. And so it'll be the first app that you see, this Gmail offline app that has been created by Google. So I'll click Add to Chrome. So after some installing, this new icon will appear in my Chrome browser. So I'll click on that. The first time that you install this app, it'll ask you whether or not you want to enable offline messages. So since I've already used this app before, it didn't ask me, but, but when you install it, a little screen will appear asking you to enable offline messages. So you're just going to want to click that. So when you start up your Gmail offline for the first time, it'll automatically synchronize your messages. And then from then on, whenever you have an internet connection, your messages will be synced with this app. So that means this app will be as up to date as whenever the last time you access the internet via your computer. So as you can tell, if you're a mobile user, this is kind of based off of the Gmail tablet interface. And some of you may even like this app better than the normal Gmail app because it's a little bit more simplified and it reminds me of that tablet interface that I mentioned just a second ago. But what this does have is a number of the same features that your regular Gmail interface has. So as you can see over here, these are my new messages. I can search in this text box right here and I can use a lot of the same search operators that I would have before. So let's try this out. I'll search from Albert Einstein. And this will bring up all of my messages that he has sent to me. I can also view all of my labels. When I click on this icon right here, I can scroll down and view messages by labels. I can also archive and delete messages like I would before. And finally, one of the most important features that I'm sure a lot of you will enjoy is the ability to compose a message and save it or discard it. And you can actually even send it if you have an internet connection. So that was my brief introduction to the Gmail offline app. I hope you guys enjoyed the video. And if you have any questions, please leave us a comment in the section below. Thank you.